Good day, I am Naomi Tiburcio and this is PTV News Now. DSWD Secretary Rex Cachoyan assures financial aid to rise retailers amid high ceilings. The DSWD will be giving cash assistance to small rice retailers affected by the Malacanang mandated price ceiling on rice which took effect today. President Ferdinand R. Marcus Jr. directed Gachalian to use the Sustainable Livelihood Program to help small rice retailers recover whatever losses they sustained from the temporary price cap. The president issued Executive Order No. 39, which mandates a price cap on regular milled rice at 41 pesos per kilogram and 45 pesos per kilo for well-milled rice to provide effective and sufficient protection to consumers against hoarding, profiteering, and cartels. Russian President Vladimir Putin says he is open for the return of the Black Sea Grain Deal Initiative if their demands are met. This primarily involved removing sanction on Russian exports and agricultural technology. After talks with Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan, they decided to go ahead with plans to continue the initiative to directly deliver tens of thousands of tons of grains to six African countries. Both leaders are also looking forward to finalize negotiations on the creation of a gas hub in Turkey. United States First Lady Jill Biden has tested positive for COVID-19. Strangely enough, President Joe Biden was declared negative for the virus, according to the White House officials. The First Lady is experiencing mild symptoms and will remain at her home at Rehoboth Beach, Delaware. The White House continues to monitor President Biden and will also subject him to regular testing. The United States has reported high cases of COVID-19 cases or COVID-19 and hospitalization in the past weeks. This is Naomi Tiborcio. Stay informed, be aware, get ahead, be abused, and get the news right here.